Methods of preparation and uses of some selected polymers. In a variety of forms the polymers are associated with every activity of individual, society and the civilized world. We will discuss below, the synthesis and uses of some commonly used polymers. 1. Polyethylene, polyethene or polythene. It is most commonly used addition polymer first produced in England, 1933. Two types of polyethens are manufactured. A. Low density polyethene, LDP. It is made by compressing ethene under very high pressure, and temperature range of 453523 K in presence of traces of oxygen catalyst, 0.1%. Even peroxides and hydroperoxides can be used as catalysts. The polymer formed has highly branched structure and is called low density polythene. Its molecular weight ranges from 50,000 to 3 lac. LDP is chemically inert, tough but flexible and poor conductor of electricity. It softens at comparatively low temperature 393 K and practically no solvent dissolves it at ordinary temperature. It is used in insulation of electric wires. Manufacturing of squeeze bottles, toys and flexible pipes. B. High density polyethylene. HDP. It is generally manufactured by Ziegler process. Ethene is passed under pressure into an inert solvent containing triethyl aluminium and titanium chloride catalyst. After polymerization the catalyst is decomposed by adding dilute acid and the crystalline polymer is filtered off. HDP is essentially a linear, polymer with little or no branching of chains, its molecular weight ranges, between 50,000 to 3 lac, and has higher softening point. Approximate 403. K. Uses, polythene is chemically inert, tough, pliable over wide range of temperature. It is used without plasticizer or filler and can be readily colored. It is easily molded and blown. It is used to make many household articles and in particular squeeze bottles, toys, flexible pipes. Its electrical conductance is extremely poor, so used as electrical insulator i.e., electric cables. It is readily rolled into thin film and used in sheets for packaging and as a coating. 2. Polystyrene, polyvinyl benzene it is an addition polymer of styrene, is accidentally discovered in 1839. Styrene is subjected to free radical addition polymerization to give polystyrene. Alternatively, Coordination, cationic or anionic methods can be used for polymerization. Polystyrene consists of generally linear molecules. It is chemically inert, acids, alkalis and oxidizing agents have very little effect on it. Its major defects are poor withering properties and brittleness. It softens at low temperature, approximate 358 K. So, articles made from it cannot be sturdy least. Exposure to outdoor, causes yellowing and crazing. Uses, in spite of some of its disadvantages it is used in the manufacture of molded containers, lids, jars, bottles, radio and television cabinets, toys and many other household items. 3. Polyvinyl Chloride, PVC. It is an addition polymer of vinyl chloride. The polymer is manufactured by free radical polymerization of vinyl chloride under high pressure and in presence of suitable catalyst example azo compounds or redox initiators. Uses, PVC is very tough, horn-like, polymer. So, suitable plastic is example trichrosyl phosphate, phthalic acid etc. is added to get required softness. PVC is cheapest and most widely used plastic world over. It is easy to color, resistant to weathering, fire and chemicals, and it is also a good electrical insulator hence, used of cables, in the manufacture of artificial leather, household goods such as, curtains, tablecloths, floor covering, gramophone records etc. and in the manufacture of irrigation and drainage pipes. 4. Phenol formaldehyde resin, Bakelite resins. Bakelite is the first of the modern synthetic resin. It is formed by polycondensation of phenol and formaldehyde in presence of acid or alkali. 
The nature of the product formed greatly depends on the type of catalyst and the molar ratio of the reactants. The first step is methylylation i.e., addition compounds called methylol derivatives, I, 2, and 3, are formed at ortho and para position, e.g. Similarly, addition may occur at para position to form another methylol derivative, 4. It also can form, 2, and, 3, as above. These products, I, 2, 3, and, 4, can be considered as monomers for subsequent polymerization. In next step, condensation between methylol phenols and phenol takes place to give the methylene compound. E.g. In presence of excess of formaldehyde all the available ortho and para positions of phenol molecules are cross-linked to form three-dimensional polymer. If insufficient quantity of formaldehyde is used only linear molecules called novolac are formed. The resin thus formed can be stored for any length of timing without hardening. Whenever cross-linking is found necessary, it can be affected by heating excess of formaldehyde. Uses Bakelite resins are usually compounded with fillers such as asbestos powder or sawdust and used for molding electrical items, telephone instruments, and so on. Bakelite is hard, scratch and water resistant so, it is used for variety of laminating purposes and for preparing ion exchange resins.